Wie geht's dir heute, Andrew? Wie geht's? Gut. Und uh, wie ist das Wetter heute? Wie findest du das Wetter heute, Matt? Wie findest du das Wetter? Es ist grau. Ja, ein bisschen grau. Aber die Sonne scheint. Die Sonne scheint, richtig klasse. Ja. Und was für einen Tag haben wir heute? Heute ist... Dienstag? Nein. Was? Donnerstag, richtig. Heute ist Donnerstag. Und es ist der... Erste, zweite, dritte, vierte, neunte. Ja, es ist der neunte Juni, everybody. Neunte Juni. Okay, gut. Wir haben gelesen, ja? Kurz gelesen. Yeah, we read, right? So, and what, could anybody tell me, what is the purpose of... Entdeckungslesen. And do you remember what Entdeckungslesen means? Yes, Therese. Dis discovery reading, yes. Because Entdecken is to discover. Okay? And um, what, you, what you were doing to do is to pick out some stuff out of my library, right? And you look at it, and then you try to find out... I wanted you to find five words you definitely knew the meaning of, And then five words that what? Yeah, that you thought you knew. And how how did you figure out these other words? The the ones that you think you know. Yeah. The words around it. Right, the words around it. So the words around it that you knew, and sometimes what were some other clues you had? Pictures. What else? To figure out the meaning of the word. Words within the word, remember? Because I told you in German, they love to make compound words. So it's breaking it down into pieces, right? All right, so there might be a, the, you might know one of the words, and there's three words in there, and it kind of gives you a clue as to what the rest are. So you break it down. Good. So, how is ein Freiwilliger? What's a Freiwilliger? Free willer, right, a volunteer. Exactly. So, was hast du entdeckt? What did you discover? What was the word? Can I see it? Blind. Okay. Well, that one is an easy one, right? Because it's also a what? What is that, guys? Cognate. What's a cognate, somebody? Besides you? Yeah. The word that looks like something. That's a false cognate. Yeah. So if it looks the same, And it sounds the same, and it means the same thing in both languages, that's a cognate. So blind is blind. Okay? Yeah, it's spelled the same. Okay? And actually this would also be lowercase. What things are what things are capitalized in truth? Yes, sir. Nouns, person, place, thing, or idea, right? Uh, anybody have another word that they're really proud and they think they definitely discovered a new word for themselves? Yeah. Uh, okay. Appetit. Yeah. Appetit. Another kind of cognate kind of thing, right? Appetit. Did it say something like guten appetit? Yeah, guys, what do you think guten appetit means? Yeah. Yeah, enjoy your meal. It's like bon appetit, okay? Okay, appetite. Yeah, it's like appetite, but that's but it's literally saying have a good meal. Okay, when you say guten appetit, everybody say guten appetit. Guten appetit. Okay. Did anyone have any others that they were proud of discovering? Or how about a word that you knew for sure? What's a word you knew for sure? Somebody else. Somebody else. All right, I'm getting all the same hands. Um. Yes. Bin? Bin. What's bin, everybody? Bin. I'm like I am, right? I am. Bin is M. Right? Good. Uh, Sharif? Kurz? How's it spelled? Yeah, what did you think that was? Short. Why? What was the thing that clued you into it? Thank you.
product said lying next to it, so you figured it was an opposite, right? You just used your logic here, when, and, and, and you did, you figured it out completely right. All right, so that's uh, short. Okay, yeah? Quotes are holes that are shorts. Yeah, short pants. Remember those? Yeah. We had those. All right, let's do a quick TPR. Ready? Stay out. Sight of Strecke. Sight of einen Schrank. Setzt euch auf euer Schreibtische und dreht euch um. Und dreht euch einmal um. Uh, Steht auf den Fußboden. Fasst einen Bleistift oder einen Kuli an. Zeigt auf eine Ecke mit deinem Bleistift oder Kuli. Läuft in eine Ecke mit deinem Bleistift oder Kuli. Okay, gut. Uh, läuft zurück zu deinem Schreibtisch und stellt euch auf euer Stuhle. Stellt euch auf euer Stuhle. Fasst deinen Bauch an. Fasst deinen Bauch und deinen Rücken an. Fasst deine Haare an. Fasst den Schreibtisch mit deinen Ellenbogen an. Fasst einen anderen Schreibtisch mit den anderen Ellenbogen an. Uh, fass deine Nase an. Fass deine Nase und deine Auge an. Okay, zeig auf eine Fahne. Springt von deinem Stuhl auf den Fußboden, geht zu einer Fahne und schlag eine Fahne mit deinem Hand. Schlag eine Fahne mit deiner Hand. Sehr gut. Geht zurück zu eurer Schreibtische und setzt euch hin. Okay. Auf Wiedersehen und Max.